Okay, fourth graders, here is our May 14th New ELA assignment. Sign into New ELA. And we're down here on the New LA on the 11th through 15th. Today's the 14th. And we've done ancient women surfers. We've done the graphic novelist. We've read about what Asian Americans. Today we're going to switch it up a bit and do missions destroyed Native American culture. So it's again a little bit with different cultures and, and how the missions had a problem with the Native American culture. Okay, so our activity is just a one right, and it's again. That's a central idea sentence frame, so you know how to do those, and a quiz. So this is called World History. How did Spanish missions in California affect Native Americans? Okay, there's a picture of mission in San Diego, De Acala. Remember, we went to Mission San Juan Capistrano. We learned all about missions, and we didn't get a chance to build our missions this year. Uh, they're starting to change that. What we want to learn about missions is they, they weren't always great for everyone that was on the mission, especially for Native Americans. So it was, it was sort of difficult for them. Okay. Um, the Spanish built missions in California starting in 1769. At the time, California was part of Mexico. The missions were places built to spread Christianity. They were terrible for Native Americans there. Okay. So you heard that they were terrible. The Spanish colonists used the missions to turn Native Americans into workers. The Spanish also used them to expand their empire. The colonists created 21 missions in California to do this. Native Americans were forced to move from their villages into areas near the mission. So, so it says about 80,000 Native Americans in California were forced into these mission programs. Native Americans were not allowed to leave the mission. They were forced to stop using native language and their clothing and food and their whole way of life. Thousands died from European diseases. At the age of five or six, Native American children were taken from their families and adults were forced to work for no money. It doesn't sound too good. Now, so these diseases, is this kind of like how we're having the pandemic now? There was smallpox and in, in, it was in from Europe and none of the Native Americans had ever been around it. So when the, the first um, explorers came to the New World, they brought these diseases with them and it really was bad for the Native Americans because they caught the diseases, they caught the viruses. Okay, so then there's pictures, Native Americans use a plow, you can click on that. Unipero Serra. Unipero Serra started the first mission in 1769. We know about Father Serra. He started eight more by 1782. These led to all the others. Pope Francis made him a saint in 2015. Saints are people that Catholics believe are very close with God. Many Catholics want him, wanted him to be a saint even in the 1700s. Some Catholics say Native Americans were better off because of the colonists. Others see things much differently. They say that everywhere the Spanish put in mission, most of the Indians are now gone. The Spanish took land and crops from the Indians. They also mistreated them. Sarah let these things happen. As a result, many do not believe he deserves to be a saint. So native resistance to missions. It says Native Americans fought back in many ways. The most common way was to ignore orders. Many missions, Native Americans refused to learn Spanish. Others pretended not to understand Spanish commands. They worked slowly or poorly on purpose. An escape was not easy. Soldiers could track down runaways. Thousands of Native Americans tried to escape. Only about 8,000 were able to get away. Indians sometimes poisoned the priest. In 1836, Indians kidnapped one. They whipped him too. Some burned down missions. 
Others killed the Spanish colonists. But the Spanish had better weapons, and in the end, many Native Americans gave in to the Spanish troops. Still, many of them refused to return to the mission. They told the colonists that they would live off whatever they had out in the open country. They could provide for themselves by their work. Diseases, here, so they're talking about the disease again I was telling you about. Diseases from Europe killed most Native Americans. About 100,000 Native Americans in missions died from the illnesses in California. The missions were finally ended when Mexico gained independence from Spain. The new Mexican government closed the missions. Remember, California was once part of Mexico, and the missions were finally ended in 1836. Okay, so this article, you know, we learned about some of the good things in the mission. This article is telling you another side of some of the bad parts of the missions. Sometimes things have good and bad. Okay, so there's some more pictures you can see. Um, and your activity is just going to say, give us a, um, the central idea. What did you learn from this, the main idea from this article? And then you have a quiz, okay? All right. So we will talk to you later and good luck. Bye.